How this nigga just wearing like a fucking vest, some pants, some snow boots, and like a coat that's barely covering anything over this nigga's head? Not fucking feeling the cold more than like a fucking little back covered in fur, nigga. Alright, so. What's going on? Dust, be careful. Watch overhead. The snow is not the only thing you are shaking loose. What else? So you couldn't be cryptic, nigga. You could have just... Oh shit! Never mind. I see it. Nigga, cause I'm looking up above while I'm trying to fight these niggas, yo, to try to dodge them ice circles, Cause I don't know how much them shit's gonna take up. See, it hit me right there, but I wasn't looking, cause I was looking up at the ice circles instead. Fuck. Really? They fucking with me right now, right? Oh, I see. Alright, I got it. I was just about to try to zoom right past some fucking spikes and shit. the snow for this nigga. Alright. So I made the right decision coming down here. I just wanted to see because I was like, yo, I've never seen any dev drops in this game. So. That's Shaky. I think you need a fucking wall chicken. I'm just looking at this shit. Let's see. Yup. That's why I want to stay on there. I have a feeling they might have something down there. They still got more treasure in this area. Fuck. Man. Nigga, this shit moves a lot faster than that other shit. Really? Nigga, this nigga don't even get fucking stunned by fucking parrying, nigga. Fuck it. I do not even... I hate when I mean to switch my shit, yo, and I use a healing item instead. Make sure I ain't skip the undo with all my little flying around and shit. Hold on, nigga. Fuck. See, I knew there was something down there, yeah. That's the only reason why I went down there. Because the way they had them shits over there, they. I think that's the thing, yo. They expect you to think you're getting tricked into a death drop, yo, so. How the fuck? Alright. Fuck! I'm about to get another level up soon? Shit. Some, uh... There you go. Uh, attack. All my shit going towards attack, yo, because I'm not taking no shit on anybody. Check my blueprints now that I think about it. 
Cause I feel like there's a good chance I might have got a new blueprint to be able to do something about this. Damn icicles falling and shit, yo. I'm over here dodging everything while I'm attacking these niggas. There you go. I am. Oh, fuck. Hey, I need more. <laughs> Can't get this fucking item yet. I can afford this one though. Fuck it. I guess it'll keep me over until they restock. Uh, yeah, that's gonna defeat the purpose, yo, because I'm trying to... Damn, yo, that shit puts fidget up so fucking much, though. Fuck, yo. I think I want to do that one. I lose kind of a bit of attack, yo, but that shit puts fidget up a lot. I don't get my bonus for a gold drop no more. Bro. Just looking at these shits. Just keep putting down my attack, yo, because this shit barely gives me anything towards my attack. Still, they fucking with me. So why did I come out of this area before I found this shit? I don't fucking know. I'll probably find out soon. Yeah, this shit take like 300 a piece yo because I boosted up fidget shit so much fuck see all that power from that damn move man from fidget shit man Sacrifice my attack, you know, use fidget shit. So, I said, well, I sacrificed like 40. Yeah, they saying that there's more over here. I haven't found shit. Unless it's up there, you know, and I gotta use that little zoom and boost bullshit to do it. I hate when they make me do that shit. Seem like it, cause they got a lot of enemies over here. I might have to. Oh. I might have to take that shit off of fidget first. But she gonna kill everybody in like two hits here with that goddamn. I saw that thing going both ways. I guess I'm just gonna wait for it. I don't know where it's gonna lead me. so much goddamn money in this fucking game now that it Just stop. Oh, I 
think I'm coming down with something. Yes, it is. You figured that out. Calm down. Let us continue. Another level up, nigga. Didn't I just have one like two minutes ago? Oh, yeah. Uh, attack. Something sacrificed too much fucking attack lately. So I know that was a hint that they want me to you like kill them singing chick. They gonna probably give me more of those. I gotta kill them singing chick near that thing. It's not this, huh? What the f Oh, it's Come on, let's get back to the surface. Be careful, Dust. I sense a powerful presence has been stirred by your actions. Really? Let's not keep it waiting then. Alright, let's go. That shit. That means I'm gonna have to find a way to get back over the other side sooner or later. the next one go by. Oh, fuck. Nigga. What is it going on? Oh. I'm just trying to look for the highest ground I could possibly get to. If I can make this quick, yo, I guess I could do it without having to go back. Let's see, let me see this, let me see this. Fuck, nope. Damn. Wait, I gotta circle all the way back around. This will it's like I want it. Let me guess, it's down here. Yep. I'm going the next time on underneath the cave. Right there on the map, didn't need no more treasure, but I'm like, oh, I wonder if there's some, no, some other alternate route I can take going that way. No, nigga. They never had no goddamn alternate routes in this game, but I'm like, nope, nigga. Alternate route. I 
not going under there. Nigga, that shit is a long way away. Oh, oh I ain't even. Oh, yo, that's snow, yo. That's why I couldn't see this thing. Now with that hey. I can't see anything. Yeah, they try to make it difficult for you to see anything over here. Shit. All this crap crumbles to be able to get on there. I am in. Yeah. Do something with that. Yeah. Just that one area. Well, I couldn't find that crap to save my damn way. If you play this game enough, yeah, you pretty much know that a lot of times when they have them things, they try to lead you in the spike. I think I'll go health next time. No, I'll go to hey health here. Yeah. Nope. I'm not paying attention at all whenever I come. What the? Oh, I. I ain't get it. I thought I had to wait for them to read. Like crumble them and then wait for them things to dissolve until that thing's left and then run across. Nope. What? Oh. Them shit. Nope. That still wasn't it for this area's treasure. Let's see what else they got. Oh, fuck. I was just trying to follow that thing. It's like, nah, nigga, we going over here. Oh, oh found it. Yeah. If I just eat that shit, ah, fuck. fuck it. I'm gonna try it. Make it, eat it. I don't feel like going all the way back around. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Oh, why? Yeah. Nigga. 
Yo, eat your cake, nigga. Yeah, this nigga goes so hard, slow, yo. Let's try to test your patience for if you want to try to get that shit. Oh my god, yeah, yeah. All I do is test your damn patience, yo. That's it. I think if I want to get it, y'all need to go down. Oh, I see it. I'm just looking at it. They like, nope, nigga, you didn't find all the treasure yet. This better be the last one, man. Wait, you can pretty, you can pretty much tell, right? Just right now, exactly why I never record this crap. Never feel like you know, Well, I thought I could probably do this circle all the way back around. This crap, that's what test my patience because I don't feel like waiting. I wish I could just turn this shit up a little bit. Really? Nigga, it ain't even let me jump, double jump up. I don't want to catch a ride. I touch your pages so much because it should argue why they make it go so slow just so that they give you an opportunity to actually be able to get past it, but still. Still that one area where I couldn't find a goddamn mother treasure. Still didn't find all that nigga sheep over in mud pots. This goddamn snow nigga. Can't see nothing. I want to get their treasure. I'll probably do have to go down there though. More and more looking treasure. If I was paying attention, I wouldn't know there wasn't no treasure on that last spot I was in. That nigga just hit me. Now I gotta fight him again. You say just let me zoop off. Oh, shit. I can't. My dodging ain't on point with all this guy here snow on my face. Fuck. I thought it was gonna knock me right back down, yeah. That's the majority of the reason why I said fuck. Man, because with them new items I got, I boosted up bitches. Shit so much. Yeah, might actually have to go down. Yeah, found it. It's goddamn treasure hunting. Oh, no, we corny. When we cut down, this shit still gonna be born as a motherfucker. Wait. Oh, five dollar treasure. I could go. I could really go. At least for this area. This stuff up one more fucking area. I ain't finding this crap. Oh, yeah. This is maybe the last spot. Find the new shit. Nope. I got three more to get. Your transaction. Thank you. Three more, nigga. 
I can't even get a nigga who pins for food. What the? Oh my god. Uh, it's really fucking annoying. Made me spend more than I wanted to on that bullshit. Get back and stop. Nobody not to be found. Oh shit! There was a road here. I remember it. Before that day. <laughs> I got a little bit of a tidbit. I ain't going the right way. Oh Look, shit! Look up ahead, a village. All the way up here? Do you think it's that moonblood camp Kane was talking about? No, it's something else. It's en enough talking. Let's get up there. There we go. They should let me play as evil dust. Halt! When I kill everybody. Oh shit. What? No. Impossible. Except I think they already said his real Cassius. name is Cassius. Yep. What did you call me? Who are you? What are you doing in this place? You. You were dead. No. No, this is not possible. I don't know what demon you are, but you will not step any closer. Kill this thing. Oh shit. Make this they should have some epic ass music for this bullshit. Oh shit. Who's we? Talking about, and who is Cassius? That's not. It's not my name. I remember it. I know it when I heard it. Like this place has been destroyed for quite some time. A year, actually. Huh? How do you know that? This was Ginger's village. I was here one year ago. According to Fuse, according to Ginger, I helped murder everyone in this village. Oh, Damn. dust. But I don't remember any of it. I remember this place, but it feels like it's been more than a year. Aro, what does it mean? It only means that things are not as they seem. Explore the village further, Dust. Let us see what secrets it has. Nigga, hides. he knows all the answers and he's just like, nah, nigga, I ain't telling you shit. Fuck you. I'm telling this you. House. I'm the Do other you dust. Something, dust. This is impossible. Didn't somebody already say this nigga got two souls? Dust. How do you see now? See what? But how, Ara? I don't understand. The answers lie above, Dust. Above what? A window? Oh shit! Ginger. Anime she was nigga. sleeping right here on the night I came to say goodbye. But I hesitated. I didn't want to wake her. Didn't want her to worry about me. She couldn't know what I was about to do. Just... What are you saying? She couldn't know that I was about to go avenge our parents. You mean... Uh, she... You're... But how? What's going on here? I... I 
can remember now. But how? How can I have helped destroy this village, but be a victim of that same act? That's impossible. Only impossible for a creature with a single soul. Ginger. Those eyes. I know those eyes. So, Mithrarin, you finally see the truth. Who are you? I am Elder Grey Eyes, leader of the Moonblood people. Well, what's left of them, that is. What did you mean just then, that I can finally see the truth? What do you know about me? His eyes, Elder. They are Jin's eyes. So his name is Jin. They do look remarkably similar to your brother's, yes. That is because his soul lives on within dust. What? However, to suit our needs, we required two souls. The soul of innocence is a noble thing, but without skill, without power, dust would have been struck down just as easily as your brother was on that fated day. No. So we combined your brother's soul with that of his murderer, the royal Jeez. assassin known as Cassius. Yeah, they. they perished at the same time, forever entwined. Never before had I heard of such an event. Damn. You murderer! My parents did nothing wrong! You have been deceived, little one. Your parents turned against their king in acts of pure treason. What resistance there was, was led by your family alone. You destroyed my village, murdered my friends and family. You will not survive this day! I take no joy in slaughtering one as young as you, child. But you have forced my hand. A grave injustice was done that day. Cassius murdered a defenseless Jin, but his pride and arrogance proved to be his undoing. But how? How can this... this thing be my brother? It's not possible. I couldn't even remember you when we met. You are Jin, yes. But you are also Cassius. Two souls, forever at odds. One of innocence, one of power. Together you form the one we call Mithrarin, he who is born of the dust. I never knew what happened. Jin just disappeared one night. I had always hoped he would turn up alive someday, that he would come back. But could you really be him? Ginger, I don't know. I... I don't know. Now, Dust, I imagine you have many questions. Please, do not hesitate to ask them. Nigga. Who, or I guess, what am I? You are what my people call Sen Mithrarin, he who is born of the dust, created from the essence of the life thread itself. You see, my people have been on the verge of extinction for a great many years. General Gaius planned to eradicate us once and for all. And while our warriors are proud and strong, what chance would we have against such a powerful foe? To defeat General Gaius and save our people, we would need a warrior capable of standing against an entire army. This warrior would also need to be pure of heart, incorruptible. So that's why you picked Cassius and Jin, just like you said, opposites. Exactly. Cassius was one of the greatest warriors this world has ever seen, and Jin's purity of heart would help guide our warrior to save our kind. From their fallen souls, you were born. Born to save us, to save this world. Why did I only remember now? I didn't even recognize Ginger when I met her. You may possess the souls of two separate beings, but your body and mind are your own. You were created to save this world, so we felt giving you memories of either soul would simply distract you from the task at hand. 
I had no idea who I was, what my purpose was. You say that, but in all cases, you did exactly what we intended you to do. Who the fuck is we? You saved complete strangers outside of Aurora Village. You stopped our wayward brother Fuse from destroying all that we sought to save. You saved Mudpot and brought the waters of life back um, to this land. Lord. You purged a demonic rage from this land and even helped two old souls find peace once more. You may not have known your purpose, but that did not stop you from fulfilling it. And now I'm here. Yes, now you are here. And we can finish this fight once and for all. Who is Fuse? He said he was a Moonblood, but he looks nothing like you. Fuse. He was once a fine warrior and a close friend of Ginger's family. He would help transport goods between this village and our camp. After the village was destroyed, I guess he lost his mind. He was horribly disfigured after the attack. The only way he could survive was in a special suit of magical armor that I helped to construct. He demanded we attack General Gaius right away, but I would not hear any of it. He would have killed us all in the name of vengeance. We would not have stood a chance. When I refused to send our warriors into battle, he called me a coward and vowed that he would destroy Gaius with or without my help. I fear the very armor we made to save his life had corrupted his mind and body beyond repair. Poor guy. If only we could have gotten through to him somehow. No, you're right to kill him. If he had remained alive, there's no telling what damage he could have done. Ginger is right. Fuse was beyond saving. For all our sakes, I hope the same is not true of the world he sought to protect. How does the Blade of Ara fit into all this? What is it, exactly? It is one of the five blades of Elysium. Ancient weapons forged when our kind were many. And the way of the flameless light was commonplace. Wait, wait, wait. What the heck is the way of the flameless light? A path we Moonbloods continue to follow. It is a way of living, a way of thought, that allows us to make use of a power both old and great. Magic without magic. I am so confused. Pretty much. Surely, as Nimbat Sword Guardian, you studied the ancient doctrines. You must know, in the event that the sword is summoned by its rightful owner, you are obligated to follow. I may have skipped over that chapter? You haven't answered my question. The Blades of Elysium were created to guide their sword bearer's dust. I was summoned to your side to ensure our balance was maintained between the souls within you. Ah, my old friend. It is good to hear your voice once more. It has been a long time, Master. Wait just a second. How can you possibly know each other? My clan's been keeping the sword hidden for over 200 years. Master Grey Eyes has lived for a very long time, Fidget. Longer than any of you. So you were sent to keep an eye on me? To help you reach your true potential. Nothing more. Level up, nigga. I have no more questions. What now? You must join us in the Moonblood camp to the north in the Everdawn Basin. That isn't anywhere near the Everdawn Volcanoes, is it? They are one and the same, yes. Really? Well, that's fantastic. Volcanoes. Volcanoes? Great. Indeed. What a better place to hide than in the most volatile land in all the kingdom. Oh, I know. How about a peaceful meadow? Or a quiet forest? Or some place that doesn't explode every 10 minutes? Dust, your friend seems awfully tense. Nigga. No! Volcano. I'm fine. Come on, let's go to the Blowy Oak Mountains. Really? I'm serious. Fidget, you need to have more faith in me. I'll have faith in you when you have faith in yourself. How about it, huh? Who are you? Really? I am... I... Uh... You see? You still haven't figured it out yet! Lizard guy tells you right to your face, and you still don't know! 
Fidget, please calm down. You mustn't test your friend like this. I just... <sighs> if I'm gonna follow you to the literal end of this world, I need to know who I'm following and why. I understand, Fidget. You're right. I can't ask you to follow me. But I can. Fidget, you have stood by Dust's side for this entire journey. You have watched him save this world. How can you continue to doubt? I just don't get it. It doesn't matter who he thinks he is. He's dust. That's who he is. That's who I know. Fidget, please. I can't do this without you. Okay, nigga, I like the name Jim better. Can you repeat that? Dust ain't no name. I can't do this without you. I'm sorry. I just... Nobody's ever said that to me before. It's just stupid. be the last time, I assure you. Are you ready, Mithra? See, I'm Cassius, nigga. The Black Sea is, nigga. Really? Really? <coughs> well, that just happened. Fuck it. Blackout! Blackout! Blackout!